If you dream about selling your own Notion templates but you don't want to create them from scratch, a PLR template is what you need. Basically, a PLR Notion template is a template that it's pretty much done for you. So you just have to customize it and you can get ready to sell and sell that template as your own. So you can sell that on your shop. Today I'm going to be sharing with you in this video my process, how I would get a page in this in this Notion template, get it ready to sell. So I, how I customize it, how I change the covers, the Canva templates, the Canva covers, and I make it completely unique. I'll leave the link in the description. And basically here you have the tutorials on how to customize everything, but I'm gonna show you in this video how you can customize it as well. So the first thing we need is to duplicate this template Let's make a copy of it. So let me just um, duplicate that into another account. Now I'm going to create the Notion cover. So it's basically the main banner that is going to show up in my template. And I want a that girl vibe of a template. So I'm just going to drag the images that I want. Okay, so here is the, um, the template, is the PLR template that I duplicated and I'm not going to customize all the template because it has so many pages but what I'm going to do actually, I can just drag it down and this is going to be my template. I This is the template that we are going to customize it and you can sell this just this page as a template because it includes a meal planning, goal planner, uh, workouts and so many other things and habit tracker as well. So we're just going to customize this. So I'm going to save the cover that I created in Canva and uh, if you have the pro account just make sure you save that with a transparent background because this is going to help you when you, if you use the black, um, if you use dark mode, this is going to automatically adapt to your theme. Now I'm just gonna add the cover that I just created. You can reposition that. You can also change the images for the habit tracker if you want to, but I want to keep it very simple and I'm, I'm going to remove the card preview and I want to leave it like this. This as well, I want to change the layout and I want to just show the cards. And what I can do as well is to create a gallery view. What I can do here, I, I can create new cards and what I'm going to do, I'll drag these pages into the cards and when I go to the page, I'll turn this into text so the person can see their goals and everything else. So this is going to be fitness goals. Make sure you add an icon as well. Do the same for the other cards, turn it into text.
Okay, so now I want to add images in this card cover. So I need to create a property. I'm going to create a files in media and I'm going to name it as cover. And I'm going to create my own covers in Canva. So once I've done with this, I am going to download these um, covers that I created. I just want to download the ones that I that I created now. So it's 13 to 15 and save them with a transparent background as well if you can. So what you need to do here is to edit this cover property and you're going to add the icon that you just created so this one is for goals this one do the same thing here this one is for workouts And now what you want to do is to go into the layout, card preview as cover. So this is how it's going to show up. But as you can see, it's a little bit too big. So if you are going to create, you can either reduce the size uh, of the icon in Canva and download it again, or you can fit image like this. So this is an option. You can also drag this to the top if you want to. Um, so what I like to make it very visual to the person that is using so they can just click and go into different categories. You can also hide the name, add all the categories. If you want to, you can create more pages. Um, it also depends on the person that you are creating this template for. So let's also customize the text because I'm already using brown here. So a shortcut is to press Command Shift H to repeat the color that you just used. So you can do that here. Um, and this habit tracker it's already done for you the the habit tracker you can customize here it's a button so if you go on this settings you can customize the covers if you want to um, and the layout we are going to leave it as none but you can also create the covers and this is it You can also hide the database title and I like to rename um, the databases and just put a space so, and you can also change the icons. And you can also create more pages and what would be useful for your ideal customer let's say you are creating for that girl um, so let's say favorite um, extra resources page with like you inspiring youtube videos that could be an idea healthy recipes so everything you can just leave it here like very easy to access uh, so this is just an example but you can basically sell this as a template itself and once you are done with the template when let's say you finish the template you are going to take a screenshot so i'm just gonna press um just gonna take a screenshot of my page just gonna take it right here because i don't want to show myself and save that if you are planning to sell this template you're gonna need to give the person your customer a pdf download so to create one i have a template done i have a canva template in the plr template kit that you can use but you can easily create that yourself in canva as well and all you need to do is just add 
add the image that you took a screenshot from from your template and you can also customize that with your brand colors so you can use like try to get the same colors that you are using in the template so that makes it look nice um, and you can also customize the button using like the same colors just to make everything looks cohesive and once you are done with this PLR, with the PDF download you need to make sure you add the link that you are going to share with your customers so you need to press publish and make sure this is on so you copy this link and if you click in the in any text or anything in Canva this is gonna show up so you click on it and you are going to paste the template link so you can see link is being added and if you save this as a PDF download let's just save page one so you save that as a PDF you should be able to click on it so this is the file that your customer is going to get so when they get the template link they are going to be able to duplicate that and use um, edit and customize it and everything else hey do you want to get seven to seven notion template ideas that are actually profitable so if you want that i've created a notion template with endless notion template ideas that people are actually looking for so if you want that the link is in the description it's free you just have to sign up and you receive this template ready on your inbox if you enjoy the video please leave a like below and subscribe to my channel so i can keep creating more videos like this for you and 90 percent of my viewers they are not subscribed to my channel so if you like videos like this just subscribe to the channel so you keep receiving them every week and i hope i see you on the next one bye